Hi everybody, today I'm going to do a look which is mainly going to be using Coastal Sense products. For those of you who don't know, Coastal Sense is a brand. You can go to coastalsense.com or you can get their products on eBay and they do some really lovely um, products. So I'm just going to get on with it. If I'm not using Coastal Sense, I'll probably be using MAC to be honest. Um, so I'm going to rely on the products because I've noticed my last couple of videos, when I go like that, you lose half my face, which is probably a good thing. <laughs> But right, we'll start. I'm just going to prep my face with some primer and it's MAC Prep and Prime Skin Base. You notice my fringe is already misbehaving, splitting in the middle. Oh well. brush I'm going to uh, put some foundation on going in a downward stroke Blending the rest with my fingers. And then going over with some Laura Geller, Laura Geller Mineralized Makeup, which I got from New York, just to set my foundation. Coastal Scents, it's actually an eyeliner, it's from their new, they've just released eyeliners. It doesn't actually have a colour on there, but it's the green one. I think, oh, do you know what? I'll have a look at my order and see what the actual colour was, so I'm going to dab that on there. Three quarters of the way up. So it's an eyeliner, but you can use it as a eyeshadow. It's lovely and pigmented, so we're going to put some eyeshadow on top just to set the colour. Once right, so we've gone three quarters of the way up, I'll do the same on the other eye. palette. If I can open the thing. From the end, that colour. <laughs> so I'm going on there. Just to set the colour, it's quite a similar colour. putting this powder colour here on the actual lid and not all the way up. Okay. And then with my MAC 224, I'm going to get a black from the corner, the very end. Three quarters of the way out. Do that bit there. 
do that a bit there and we're going to blend with a different brush. and then we're going to do the um, windscreen wiper motion we only want to put black in the outer V which is this bit here god my eyelid, eyebrows are so, my um, eyelids are so wrinkly it's not even funny I think I need an eyelid tuck using the Coastal Scents Black, True Black, that one's actually got a sticker on, and I'm using a Snazaroo face painting brush. You can also use um, the nail art brushes, which are really, really cheap if you can't afford to go out and get, um, you know, the, the higher end brand. So I'm going to go under there. Perfect for eyeliner. I also do face painting on my niece and nephews. I use this for that as well. So it has two uses. It's initially for face painting. But if you go on eBay or go to your um, art stores, they're there. takes practice so don't beat yourself up if you don't get it right first time but that's the point of getting the, the brushes they help with the application the thinner the brush the better and the more flexible I find I hate the eyeliners where they're on a, a nib if you like I prefer the brushes because you can blend and move them let's see you got that and now I'm going to put some blush on again coastal scents and that's just breaking in front of me, that brown one. And I'm going to use my 168 brush. And I might go for that broken one in the corner. A bit of both. That one, middle one and that one there. Apples of the cheeks and then moving outwards. So I'm going to get a really thin brush. This is a NARS blending brush. I'm just going to get one of the dark browns here. Can you see? And just tidy up here. Just make them look a little darker. Yeah, we're done. Bye.